Welcome back, agents. Oh, hold on just a second. I need to finish a mission. All right, I had to take care of a spider. Sorry about that. We're glad to have you back. But before we start our mission with Sammy, I have an important file for you to read. It is John 3.16. So if you need a moment, pause this video and memorize these words. Oh, hello. Are you guys ready for mission number two? So I was looking through the files and guess what? I found G-O-D under a different name. It's actually Agent J. And the biggest surprise is that Agent J died on a mission to save the whole world. And he was successful. What a hero. But what was the mission? I don't see any of those informations on here. Hmm, maybe I can log into Agent J's computer and find out more. All right. I just need to sneak into his office. Let's find out where it is. So it looks like his office is right in this room. All right, let's take a look. His door's unlocked. Let's hurry, guys. Oh, it needs a password. Wait, that's a hint. Oh, let's see, what does it say? Agent J is the secret to unlock this? Hmm, wait a minute. It looks like some letters are different. They are bigger. Let's read it. I think the first one is a J, and then it's an E. S, U, S. Let's try this. Access granted. Now we can see the super secret files. Whoa, and it says Jesus' death brings life. Wow, that must be the next key to God's heart. So Agent J was actually J-E-S-U-S, -S, Jesus. Wow, and look what we found. This is the next key card. I will keep it with me for safe keepings. Oh, someone's coming. I gotta go. All right, spy trainers, you guys take it from there. Did you guys find out who Agent J is? It's Jesus, right? And do you know who J-E-S-U-S -S died for? He died for you, he died for me, he died for everyone on the whole earth, right? But when he died, was it just so that we could all go to heaven? What do you guys think? Well, that's a part of it, but it's not all of it. Let me put it this way. So do you guys remember way back when Adam and Eve sinned? Do you remember that in the garden? When they sinned, it took away all the access that they had to God, right? But when Jesus came and he laid down his life for us, that actually gave us back that access right to God, right? And until Jesus came and died and resurrected, the Holy Spirit was waiting to come down and live with us and in us and around us so that we could live just like Jesus lived. The Holy Spirit brought life with him after Jesus' death. So you guys, Jesus is the ultimate spy. He went on this secret mission. He laid down his life so that we could have access back to God. Now, we wanna give an opportunity for any of you that have not accepted Jesus into your heart to do that today, or for any of you that are wanting a new relationship or a deeper relationship with Holy Spirit. So I'm gonna pray with you. The first people I'm gonna pray for are those of you who have not accepted Jesus into your heart. So this is what I want you to do. Put your hand on your heart, and I want you to repeat after me. Jesus, I want you to be part of my life. I want to have you live in my heart and be part of my life from now on. Jesus, I give you my life and I accept your love and compassion in mine. Now, if you just gave your life to Jesus, I want you to make sure you share this with someone. It's the most important thing that you can do in your life. And so sharing it with someone you trust is super important. So share with a family member or a sibling or someone that you trust. Now, I wanna pray for those of you that want a deeper relationship with Holy Spirit or maybe for Holy Spirit to fill up your life and your body and your heart too. So if that's you, I want you to put your hand on your heart. I'm gonna pray for you. 
Holy Spirit, we pray for all of those listening that are wanting more of you to experience your presence right now. For you to come into these homes, for you to come into these rooms where people are listening, and for you to touch these lives with your Holy Spirit. For them to feel you in a tangible way. In Jesus' name, amen. So that's all for mission two. And we're going to see you guys next week.
Yeah, Jesus. 
make his face shine upon you and be gracious to you.